He was the son of a Spanish seafarer and an Irish mother, and he came to Atlanta from Savannah in 1879. Martin Amaris was 21 years old, and he was in the lumber business, and he was good at it. He made a lot of money, and he gained social status in Atlanta. He was a pal of Henry Grady's and a founding member of the Capital City Club and the Piedmont Driving Club. A respected member of the Atlanta business community, he even served a couple of terms on the Atlanta City Council. During one of those terms, Martin Amaris focused his attention on a 185-acre parcel of land on the outskirts of Atlanta. He and other Atlantans ponied up $98,000 and they bought that land, trusting that the city would pay them back. And that's exactly what happened in May of 1904 when Councilman Martin Amaris made a motion that the city of Atlanta buy the land we know today as Piedmont Park. This is Lance Russell, and that is one of the stories of Atlanta. <laughs>